Good morning, Hoosiers, and welcome to Paper News 24-7, brought to you today by Fort Hawk Consulting, business efficiency specialists. Your local news in three minutes or less starts right now. I'm Stu Clanton with Montgomery County's top headlines. The public was invited to share thoughts with Mayor Todd Barton Monday evening. He was at the Cracker Barrel as part of the Mayor's monthly community meeting series. Also in today's news, all City of Crawfordsville offices will be closed on Friday for Good Friday. Since the Crawfordsville Street Department will be closed on the day, there will be a double trash pickup on Monday. Both Friday's route and the normal Monday route will be collected on Monday. If you don't know the candidates for the upcoming primary election in May, you'll soon have the opportunity to change that. On April 23rd, the primary candidates forum for 2015 will be held at the Crawfordsville High School Auditorium. The forum will begin at 6 p.m. and details are available in today's print and e-editions. From 9 a.m. to noon on Saturday, history buffs and volunteers of all ages will join forces to pick up and restore the grounds at the General Lou Wallace Study and Museum. That's going to be part of the National Initiative to Protect Civil War Heritage Sites. That's your local news for today. Your forecast looks like this. Today looks sunny with a high near 64. Tonight should be mostly clear with a low around 36. Wednesday looks sunny as well with a high near 65 degrees. And Wednesday night we see our first chance of rain mostly after 2 in the morning. It will be partly cloudy overnight with a low around 50. Thursday we see the chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Then showers are likely and possibly another thunderstorm after 8 a.m. We'll have mostly cloudy skies with a high near 69 and an overnight low on a rainy Thursday around 45 degrees. That's your local weather and news. Sports with Neil Burke is up next. Hello sports fans. I'm Neil Burke and here's what you need to know today in Montgomery County Sports. They say good pitching, good defense, and timely hitting are the keys to success in baseball. The Crawfordsville Athenians got all three Monday evening in their season opening 7-0 shutout of the Greencastle Tiger Cubs. The North Montgomery baseball team also got its season underway by playing host to 4A number 4 Lafayette Central Catholic. The Knights proved their rating was legit with a 7-3 win over the larger Chargers. <laughs> The Southmont baseball team opened its 2015 with a 14-2 loss to Class A No. 2 Rockville. In softball action, Crawfordsville was defeated, while North Montgomery and Southmont both picked up wins. You can read more about those in today's paper. And that was your 3 minutes of local news. For more information on these and other stories, click on our e-edition or pick up a print copy of the paper Montgomery County. For Paper News 24-7, I'm Neil Burke.